She told me last minute, like, I'm like, because I was supposed to get, I got my ring resized and my um ankle bracelet fixed. And then I was like, oh, I need to go to the mall to go pick it up, da 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 da, because it wasn't ready yesterday. She was like, oh, you know that I was due at the mall closes at six o'clock. And I'm just like, no, I didn't know that. <laughs> so here it is, like, five, almost 5.30. Uh, as you can see, a lot of things are not open. This is usually open, but I'm guessing because it's Sunday. Um, but yeah, hopefully they have my jewelry because I'm moving super random, but I want to show you guys what I got from Walmart. It's been sitting here for a while because I kind of like took a nap, but I feel like we need some paper towels in here because we have like such a big kitchen now and we just don't have towels down here. So, and then I just got some shredded cheese because I always put cheese on my eggs in the morning and I heard from... The person, I forgot, I shouted her out yesterday about um, her channel I was watching. She said that the Olay was really good and it was like one of her faves, like random faves. So, and I smelled this one, it was like really good. So this was like my favorite, so I'm trying this out. And of course, I always get this. Um, th I usually get the bigger one from like when I wanna feed, drink, have drinks for my whole family, just put it in the refrigerator. But when I kind of like by myself and eating alone, which is most of the time, I grab these. But I just grabbed one this time because I'm like mostly a water girl right now. Then I went ahead and grabbed some cream cheese because I want to have some cream cheese with salami and I think it's called pepperoncinis. My homegirl Alana Grandma will be hooking it up. So I really want to make my own version. It's super good. Then I went ahead, this water bottle is mine. I went ahead and grabbed, remember yesterday I told you guys that I normally have the purple ones, where I tried the purple ones and they smell really good. They're called Moonlight Breeze. So here's the purple ones and I still have the pink ones in the car, but I just want to have both just to stack up. And I went ahead and got some Kaboom. You guys remember that um, commercial, <laughs> OxyClean. So I've been looking for this for a while. Like I was really looking for the Bubbles ones, but Kaboom works. Anything that like foams up, I think this foams up. I hope it foams up. Sprays on blue. Okay, anyways, yeah. So this goes in the bathroom. So we can have our own. And then again, I got another flavor. Kiwi strawberry. The other one was strawberry watermelon. And then I got my cage free. Usually I get the different type of brown eggs. But these ones were always, honestly just cheaper. They're only $2 and some change. So I got these ones. Um, and then I'll show the ones farm fresh. So, it doesn't say organic or anything, but I'm not really tripping. Like, I, I kind of just, I'm going to try this and see what they taste like. And then last but not least, because you guys seen what I got yesterday. I got some more Eric scents, but this time this one is brown sugar vanilla. And I have no idea what it smells like, but that smells pretty good to me. And then this is, I don't even know, it's just fresh water fragrance. I don't even know. But it actually was really low, like there wasn't many left, so I just grabbed it. I'm like, it must be good because, oh my God, are you supposed to smell it right here? Is this how you smell it? I don't know, whatever, but pretty much that was, oh yeah, so hold on a second. I went ahead and bought some almond milk from Cali, Califia, Califia, yeah. So I went ahead and bought some Califia Farms vanilla, um, soy free, 50 calories per serving. At Walmart, it's actually pretty cheap because you know the organic stores be really trying to play you. So and in the eggs that I normally not to be all up in our refrigerator because we do have food. This is the ones that I normally have been getting. Oh, fresh f farm fresh. There you go. I think that's what it's called. But yeah. So and these are usually like hmm, depending where you get it, you could get it for three something, four something, or five something. So these are like the really popular ones. So guys, like I went shopping again and I spent an extra like other $50 on accident. I need to stop spending money. 
because like it doesn't make any sense i used to do so well so well with money but i think the money that i used to make and the stuff that i saved it's just like really getting to my head because like girl you don't live the same way anymore you don't have three incomes coming in like i need to really start budgeting again like really taking it serious because like i came in with a 40 dollar budget i came out with 50 something dollars worth of stuff no 45 yeah it was like 45 not too bad but still it was like dang almost 50 bucks and i went to the store every time i go to the store i'm spending like 50 dollars so I'm not even gonna show you guys what I have because I did so many like showing. So I can just, sorry by the way, I have a, I had a phone call. So I can just basically show you guys me putting it up. But other than that, I am tired of showing uh, my bad habits. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Today is, I don't know, Thursday. Um, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tatiana Edgeworth, and we are back here. So, um, I just got the shower, if you guys didn't see. And I'm about to, you know, do some other things right before I go to work. But I just wanted to come here and talk to you guys about certain things. I, like, got a ticket last night. And I was pissed. Like, real pissed. Because it's like, I haven't got a ticket in a minute. <laughs> like, a real good minute. But I don't know if it's long enough. Anyways, let me tell you what happened. So here I am, I'm off of work. I'm driving from Tracy Mountain House to Merced because you guys don't know. I moved to Merced. I don't know if I gotta say that. But I moved to Merced and then, so which is like an hour and 15 minute drive. So I'm like driving at night. And then I guess when you get off of freeway, you go onto this highway. And before I even got to see like a speed limit, I see somebody was speeding behind me. So at first I was speeding up, like, oh, okay, let me let me speed up real quick. And then I was like, you know what, let me just switch over. I'm going too fast at this point. I switch over and it's the police behind me. Like, y'all just played me. So then I was like, um, okay, girls. So I was just like, okay, um, I'll get pulled over. And then they were not to my skin color, if you know what I mean. And usually that means your girl's about to get a ticket any other freaking race i don't get a ticket they let me like not let me get away with it but like talk to me about it and see what, don't make it seem like i get pulled over like that i only got pulled over like that one time before and they were not my skin color but they weren't the opposite skin color if y'all know what i'm talking about so basically i got pulled over last night and he asked he was yelling at me like he was like roll your windows down roll your windows down and i'm like what it's like heck of confused like because i first they were following me with their lights on and then i was like oh wait i have to pull over like oh i'm delirious i'm tired i'm going off of work heck of late and i still have to drive an hour and 15 minutes they pulled me over they did give me a ticket they was like oh you're going 50 84 on 55 blah 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 but we can make it 65 for you as a favor i'm like a favor would be not giving me a god dang ticket so i was mad and I don't, I had a speeding ticket before and in California, if you have a speeding ticket, you can do traffic school, but it has to be an 18 month gap. If you do a traffic school, it doesn't go on your record and you have to pay for that. And I don't mind doing that, although whatever, but my insurance is barely getting low and I'm mad. I was so pissed last night. I'm not even going to lie to you guys because it's like, y'all could have really let me off with a warning. I'm telling you, I moved four days ago and... It's my second time driving in this back road. I had no idea it was coming off a freeway onto a highway and that the speed limit slowed down yet. They didn't even give me a chance. So I'm trying to figure out, like, can I fight that? Like, I don't know. Like, of course, the police could pull you over for whatever reason they want to pull you over. But I want to know, in court, can you really fight something like that? Because that didn't make no type of sense. Like, that didn't give me no chance to even slow down or nothing. Because as soon as I got back on the freeway after the ticket, the, that was the speed of the traffic and everything. And the, the speed limit, it was 55. But you didn't even, I didn't even see no sign before me getting off the freeway saying that the speed limit was 55. Although they're trying to help me say it was 65. I was going 84. I don't know. So when I drive home tonight, I'm going to really pay attention and make sure I wasn't tripping because that didn't make any sense. So I hope that the ticket isn't A, expensive and B, I hope I can do traffic school so I don't have to pay for a ticket. If your girl ain't got money like that. Y'all, do you know what a full-time student means? Like, that's just so crazy. So anyways, I just got out of the shower. That's what happened to me. I'm going to 
do what I gotta do for this morning, like homework and stuff and cook breakfast. I already made lasagna last night. You guys didn't get to see anything yesterday, huh? Um, but I made lasagna last night. My face is way, oh, that's why you guys didn't see me. I had this big pimple on my face. You guys, I don't like, I don't, I don't mind y'all seeing me when I look crazy, but like when I have big white zits on my face and I do not pop my pimples, I would not be vlogging my face. You guys will probably see me vlogging other things, but it will not be me. <laughs> but um, yeah, let me just go ahead and get ready and I will see you guys later. Um, comment down below of what you guys think. Am I tripping? Do I deserve a ticket? I don't think I deserve a ticket, but like just comment down below and let me know if I'm tripping. Y'all, the bridge is on fire! I, I need to get closer for you guys to see it, but whoa, 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 guys, this is gonna make me late. This is crazy. California, what's happening to us? Can y'all see? Damn. Don't worry about me. Hold on. Oh my god. What? What? Oh my god. You guys. Whoa. Are they okay? Whoa. 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 The whole car was on fire. Yo. Never seen a whole car on fire like that, yo. Oh my god. <laughs> Bro, I thought I had bad luck yesterday about getting a ticket, but I would be damned if y'all I feel so sorry for them, but luckily everybody's okay. I seen them like walking on the side, but I hope I got it. I seen it, but I don't know if I really got it. I was too busy looking at it. You know how sometimes you're too busy looking at it then recording it? I'm that is crazy. Alright, smile. Say happy birthday, me. What? Say happy birthday, me. Why can't I can't see that? Say happy birthday to yourself, dude. Happy birthday. Me. Me. How does it feel to be 10, dude? It's good. Good? Do you feel any bigger? Mm hmm. You do? How bigger do you feel? Mm hmm. Just like 10. Just like 10? Mm hmm. Oh, okay, okay. You plan on doing anything special this year for your birthday? Well, we can't go anywhere. We can't go to Disneyland because Disneyland got fully open. I, I, was, I was, I was gonna think the coronavirus is gonna be. Wait, is Disney? Wait, is Disneyland open? It should say. It should say it. Is Disneyland open? Nope. Guess what is open? Not open. Temporarily closed. Mom, oh. how does it feel to have a 10 year old son as your baby? I know, right? How does it feel? Good. You're the youngest, and then you're 10. I know I'm 10. That means she had you for a whole generation. How does uh, that feel, Mom? Uh, Spider Man web shooter at Walmart. What, how I feel? What, what was that feeling? I was 10 years old. I wasn't old enough to understand. Explain it to my peoples. Mm -hmm. Okay. Get that camera. Okay, Trayvon, say thank you. Thank you. Say bye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube. I look a mess, and today is my brother's birthday. And I wanted to tell him again, happy birthday, because he complained when I was asleep. He woke me up out of my sleep to ask me, so see, I can tell me happy birthday. Like, I'm out of <laughs> conscious right now. <laughs> it's crazy. And as soon as I walked in the kitchen, here he is, like, so see, not going to tell me happy birthday? Like, dang, can I breathe? Brush my teeth? Something. You gotta pull it. Okay, okay, he okay. wasn't bad. <laughs> hey, you two, my sister's just waxing her armpits. Oh my god. <laughs> so, are you gonna say happy to birthday, um, boy, um, YouTubers? Happy birthday. Happy okay. birthday. You're gonna do me like that. <laughs> Let me look crazy. I look crazy. Oh, 
<laughs> Damn. Okay. Hey, y'all. I really want to show them the house. No. Wait. Are they watching your video? What? Are they? Are you still recording? Yes, I'm still recording. Okay, I think that's enough to tell them. Tell them happy birthday to yourself and. And. Yes, my wait. Uh-uh, Stop. I can't show my room. No. Me looking a hot mess, but I did buy a brush from Sally's. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Tatiana Edgeworth. We are here today with my brother. And he's so unmessed. He wants me to get him a football or a basketball that he already has. Oh, you can't lower it. No, 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 stop it. You're not supposed to do that. What? Stop. Did you stop it? Why you got the camera on me? Stop. You don't want to hug? Hug me, brother. Yeah. No, heck no. Whoa. Look how cool that is. Wow. Oh, no. I want something to pop at me and scare me. Oh, wow. Do I see what? <laughs> This. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> I can't say the p word. The p word is actually a very. It's um. Penis. Yeah, that's. You can actually say that. It's a scientific word for it, so you're fine. Yeah, this is a penis. That's a penis. Wow. <laughs> that's a penis. Oh, yes, yeah. but I'm so happy right now because. Oh my God, guys, I accidentally booked my homegirl's ticket under my last name. I don't know how it happened when I swear to God, because her, 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 her last name is not a regular last name. I remember typing in that last name, but I don't know if it's like my computer, like after pushing enter, my computer automatically put my last name and I didn't pay attention and make sure before I submit it. So uh, since last night, I've been calling them. Ooh, I look a mess. But since last night, I've been freaking calling them and they had me on hold for like, First, they were talking about some two hours, and I called back. I waited. There was so much stuff last night, and I was like, okay, so I'm going to wait until, what day was that? I wait this morning, and because uh, I seen, I text them, too. And and then they're not, their number not even online. You have to, like, go through some secrecy just to find their number. But basically, I finally got their number. I got their number to text. I was hitting them up. I was just blowing them up. I was like, I don't want her to think that I'm so irresponsible, but baby... <laughs> that would be so messed up if we had to rebook or no refunds like just so much but i called them i went on hold this morning because you know it's within at eight o'clock after eight o'clock and then he just fixed it like it was nothing i'm like oh thank god because her last name isn't edgeworth only me i just want to say shout out to natalie um she told me to put a, well she didn't tell me personally <laughs> But to put a eucalyptus plant under, and it's, it's supposed to like steam and like be really refreshing. And if I'm being honest with you guys, I'm still waiting for that to happen. But aesthetically pleasing, it's really aesthetically pleasing. I think I like the way it looks in the bathroom. So yeah, you can grab these at Trader Joe's for like two ninety nine. Hi everybody. Um, it's been a while. I look crazy, but that's always that's not the point. The point is, first of all, I don't need to see the glare in my glasses. Bad news is that my brother is supposedly, supposedly supposed to be moving back here. So my plan was to turn a second room into like an office slash film room so I can like sit down to do sit down videos and like help my brother with homework and have a place for me to do my homework. I have to pee. <laughs> but yeah, so just uh, basically, you know, that was the plan. And then I got bad news that he's coming home. <laughs> and I am completely destroyed because you guys don't know what I have to live with. But that being said, I'm going to start, try to start like sticking with just vlogging videos. I am still gonna try to upload twice a week 
if that's okay with you guys. Um, maybe try to do like everything vlog style if that's possible. Like, you know, like everything I do basically is going to be vlog style. I do want to purchase a camera. I'm going to wait until, because it's already in October. So I want to wait until Cyber Monday or something like that to try to get a discount because you know your girl's cheap. <laughs> Um, and yeah, so we're just going to stick to the vlogs until maybe I move out of state and get established in a place or at least find somewhere to like, I don't know, I'm trying to make it work. But at the end of the day, I have a really, really tiny room. My bed's not together. Everything's not together still. And I still have stuff in stock in. But I just wanted to guys keep you guys an update that, yeah, there won't be any sit down videos. So you guys are just going to have to rock with me and just enjoy my boring life. So we are back from target and right here we have the dawn because i'm in charge of replacing this and then i picked up some minced garlic and you guys know i've been doing the brown eggs lately trying to keep my health on groove on so but this is a different brand i'm always trying out new brands to see if there's a difference so far there's not and then i have this lean ground beef and then I got another Glade but I'm gonna go ahead and put this one in my room instead of uh what is it called oh instead I'm gonna go ahead and put this in room instead of the bathroom I have one in the bathroom bathroom always smells good pop a litter box not so much then my friend she put me on these these are oop, good wipes um it's called Virginius. It says Virginius. Oh, here you go. You're a Virginius. Down there wipes. It's obviously to wipe your vagina. <laughs> um, this one's for the pH balance, sensual seduction. This one actually was on sale. Rosewood, amber, and retiever. Um, yeah, so I got these ones because, like I said, it was probably like a couple of cents less. And these are the ones that I actually tried. She had me try these ones, which is the rose water one. Um, they both help with the pH balance. So... You know, just to keep your girl fresh. I am not sexually active. Let's just be real. Um, not like I should be. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, I really don't need to have these on me. Sorry, guys. I be. But I feel like, you know, just keep yourself fresh, you know, sometimes. And getting older, whatever the situation is. You just, you just, you know, want to keep. Especially if you're sexually active. You guys need to keep these on hand. But, Yeah. I will guys, I will let you guys know my opinion on these beautiful vagina wipes. I also wanted to let you guys know that I found this Ling Ling Asian kitchen. Ling Ling, they so funny. But they're pop stickers. I need to put them in the freezer if they kind of been out for a while. Um, chicken and vegetable dumplings. I will definitely want to try putting these in the air fryer with some good sauce. It sounds really good. The only thing is, is that I believe, okay, so for one, is it really? No, 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 sauce. Oh, there's sauce in here? I didn't even know that. Oh, okay, so I guess it's 260 calories for five, which I think is not bad if that's all you're gonna have. Maybe like a little salad on the side or something. And then with the packet, I guess it comes with sauce, guys. Hey. And so, and that's what I want to And then I wanted to show you guys that I got some goldfish. Um, I normally don't get goldfish. It's not healthy or anything. But extra cheddar and pretzels? I mean, the pretzels is where I got sold. So I'm trying this. I am a little kid. And of course, I got other essential things from the store. Like, I'll just let you guys know what kind of bread I buy. This is the bread I've been into, the day's bread. Um, 70 calories per slice, you know, thin slice. I've been really into this. This is what I make with my avocado toast every morning. And then nothing that's like kind of different is, yeah, the Italian dry salami. And this is just for when I drive to work, you know, since I got an hour and 30 minute commute. But yeah, I just want to show you guys a little something, you know, that I got at the store. Nothing big deal. <laughs>